So it is day two of Comic Con. Um, Carl Urban has had to cancel, which I was meant to be meeting him tomorrow, so that's quite sad because he's not very well, but get well soon. So they've issued a refund on the ticket, which means I may or may not have bought a photo op with someone else. But you will see! Teasing. I am quite happy with my eye makeup. I am happy with my outfit choice because today I am meeting Sebastian Stan again, but this time it's just me and him. Um, yesterday in the photo with him and Chris, like I barely looked at Seb because I was so like that whatever that means. So today I'm getting two photos with him and one of them is going to be him pointing at my Winter Soldier tattoo. Uh, I can't wait. Just got out of meeting Sebastian Stan. Um, I'm not ready to talk about it just yet. Um, and now I'm sat waiting for the Hayley Atwell Q and A. So can't wait. I don't, I don't think that they had done this on purpose just to test me. I think they were just like scheduling wise. We can't because I haven't seen his body <laughs> yet. And I don't, I could be a bit weird if they're like, okay, Hayley, so we're going to schedule it, so you're going to have the, the private reveal of Chris's body to yourself uh, just before we do the scene. Like, I understand it wasn't like an important priority for them to schedule that time out. I would have really appreciated it, but that wasn't on offer. <laughs> I was an unknown actress back then, I get it, I couldn't make demands. So I've got a little bit of spare time um, in between Q&As and photos and stuff. So I've decided to come outside. I feel weird. I think is the only way to describe it and um, I've got another photo coming up soon um, so I'm trying not to cry which is proven very difficult um, because I'm so overwhelmed by it all um, I don't know like when you think about stuff like this happening you don't think like you'll get to do it you don't think you'll get to meet your heroes like people that you admire. Um, and like for me, Sebastian Stan is like that one person. I love him, like without sounding like creepy and pathetic, but you know, you you know what that's like with someone that you admire. Um, so meeting him today was, just to go back to what I said in the last vlog, a dream come true. Um, I don't know, it's a weird mix of emotions right now. Okay, so uh, the last part of the video, when I was speaking to you, I was slightly emotional, shall we say. Well, after that, I had a little wander around the arena, um, and I was upstairs where the autographs are taking place, because I just thought I'd have a little look around anyway, because there's like concessions up there. Um, and Anthony Mackie walked past us, and he did this. Look with us, and then, well, if that doesn't mean that one, he remembers us, and two, we're practically married, I don't know what does. So, um, obviously, I've bought another photo opportunity with him. Watch this. <laughs> they said we can't legally ask you to flip, but you 
could do it if he wanted to. So I did it, and it was Chris's first line to start the scene off. He was so shocked at what I did, he forgot the line. <laughs> well, um, I am back in the hotel um, after an amazing day. Um, that last clip was the Spider-Man Q&A, which finished off the night perfectly. Well, finished off the day perfectly, I should say. Um, oh, where do I start? I tell you where I will start. Um, I am so lucky that my Chris Evans and Sebastian Stan photo was yesterday because Chris Evans was poorly and he had to cancel as well. Um, so that's like, phew. That was all right. Um, so I said that because Carl Urban had cancelled, I was getting another photo opportunity. Let me introduce to you, if I can get it. Just me and John Bernthal. I realise that you can see the reflection of me videoing myself, but I'm tired. And I can't be bothered to take the photo out of the protective laminate thing. Sorry, Saws. Um, but yeah. He's so attractive. <laughs> um, right, so you know how I bought... <laughs> you know how I bought another photo for Anthony Mackie, right? Well, you know how I said... Like... Well, I was semi-joking at the time that he obviously remembered us when he did the whole thing, yeah. Well, first of all, let's show you the photo. Look at how darn cute we are. Look. <laughs> um, so I walked into the photo and he went, you're back. I was like, yep, come back for another little cuddle. Um, and he just like, proper laughed like I got in the photo squeezes and then in the worst British accent he went a lovely little cuddle and he was like I love that um and I was just like oh my god and he like gives a little squeeze on my face as well like pressed together like this um which was just magical um then I said like thank you so much and he said you are so welcome and he gave us another cuddle before I left I think we're basically married now, if I'm being honest with you. Right. Right. Let's cut to the real deal. My photos with Seb. So I got the photo of him pointing at my tattoo, which was just insane. He said, oh wow, that's awesome. So I was like, um, so that's that's now got Sebastian Stan's seal of approval, which is good because it's Sebastian Stan's face, um, and Chris Hemsworth's seal of approval because I met Chris Hemsworth last year and he also said it was awesome. So thank you, Gibbo. You are a legend. Um, and then... Oh, like one single tear just fell out of me eye there. Um, this weekend, and I don't mean to exaggerate, has been one of the best weekends of my life. I'm not going to forget it anytime soon. Um, I've met some lovely people. I've cuddled my favourite actors. Um, oh, it's just been... been amazing.